Well, a lot's been going on recently. In fact, so much going on that I actually have nothing to do with myself. Except, well, do this. So I've had so much to do that I really haven't done much of anything except, well, apply for jobs and all sorts of random fun things that I will talk about at some point soon. But uh, for today, uh, whoops. For today, uh, I just wanted to kind of catch you up, bring you up to speed on what I've been doing, and maybe some, some life updates as well. I just ran around in a circle, but that's okay. The first thing I want to talk about is what I've been doing on this world, and that is I finally cleared out this whole area right here. And I have been, let's put these back on, I have been really trying to get some sorting going on. So I have some some sea related things, some pickles and kelp and and coral and things. This is my valuables chest. It includes all of my wonderful diamonds and iron and and stuff like that. Uh and over here, I've got some dirt and uh diorite and my granite and andesite. Whoops, that's gravel. I still need to get a few uh, a few item frames, but that's going to be a long process because I have to do cows and things like that. So anyway, uh, it's just been uh, a bit of a long process, and uh, I've I've been trying to kind of stay organized, and I am gradually transitioning to uh, this underground kind of centralized storage system, and I'm really happy with it. It looks really good. Yes, let's eat some fish. Um, I'm really happy with it, but one thing I need to do is I need to work out this underground area. So uh, for today, I think one of the things I'm going to do is work on some walls and kind of break this up a little bit because I don't just want this giant room full of torches and just a random section of chests. So I'm going to try to make this a little bit more uh, organized. I also plan to have some kind of a kitchen down here uh, and maybe some kind of den. Another thing that I want to do is kind of uh, work out some, maybe some carpeting for around these areas, and maybe some, uh, some, some carpet for inside here. Um, and I also want to decide what to do with this room. I think I just want some kind of little sitting room, um, and yeah, I think that'll be pretty cool. So let's hop right to it, and let's begin with some working out the walls on the downstairs part. Okay, so one of the first things I want to do is I want to uh, kind of work on a little bit of a hallway situation. So let's see, let's do one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, like that. One, two, three, four, whoops, here, there we go. Uh-oh, where's my pick? Uh-oh, where's my work pick? Oh well, we'll use Silky Smooth for the minute. All right, so that's kind of be that's going to be a hallway kind of that way and this way. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, and another thing is we'll probably have a little corner here and kind of work it this direction. So let's go, whoops, that's not what I meant to do. There we go. Uh, go ahead and make this wall right here, and then I'm going to have this open up into a little bit of a room right here. So let's give us a little bit of room here just in case we want to do something with some sorting systems or something. And let's go ahead and close this off. Let's go get some more cobblestone from this chest. Yes. All right. And, ooh, excuse me. And right about here, we're going to have this kind of intersect with this wall right here and have this kind of go this way whoops man lots of misplacing right here all right and this will kind of be our uh, workbenches and and storage area hopefully we'll still have some some room for other other things maybe some brewing stands um, so this will kind of be our work area all right and we'll obviously work out some kind of ceilings in here and I haven't quite decided what I want this middle room to be. I might try to put like some kind of fancy underground pool. Uh, I think that would look kind of cool. 
So might toy around with that idea. Maybe put some some like bathrooms back in here. Um, but I'll kind of leave this open for uh, for some future future m makings and stuff. And I think what I want this to be right here is is the kitchen. So we'll have uh, let's see three. We'll have a three wide opening here and put kind of a doorway just like whoops. I think I want it to be another block up like that. Yep. And there we go. And I'll move this torch here for now. I don't have any torches, never mind. <laughs> All right. So then this will be kind of our doorway into the kitchen. And I think this is a gracious uh large kitchen. I think we can do a lot of cool stuff with this. All right. And then that way people can just uh wheel right over here. And hello, what are you doing inside my house? Wow, what a shot. Um, okay, it's night time, so we're going to go ahead and take a little sleep. Ah, a bright and sunny morning, overlooking our garden with some spiders hanging around, just because that's what they do. All right, very fine. So let's go ahead and go back downstairs and kind of get a, get a little bit of a feel. Aha, and we're back. I gathered a few materials for our next project here, and this is going to be one of the pivotal pieces of our new part. Yeah, look at that. So, <clears throat> this is a cool trick I learned from B-dubs. Uh, that, the bottom of the smithing table, even though it's a tiny bit on the expensive side, is a very nice decorative piece. So let's go ahead and craft up a few of those, and we'll kind of, uh, show you some cool things about this. Let's get about 20, alright? And we'll get the rest of these back in our inventory. And we'll just place a few of these so you can kind of see the the cool effect that it has. I really liked it, and I I, I, I wanted to... Oh, wow, that's going to be expensive. Um, I think it has a very cool feeling. It kind of has a, a parlor feel. And uh, it, it kind of connects, makes this, this checkerboard pattern. And I think it looks really nice. It's kind of a... Uh, a wallpaper, fabric wallpaper kind of feel, uh, similar to a lot of big houses that um, that existed uh, back in the day. So let's create well, two more. <laughs> That's funny. All right, so here's going to be the middle. I'm guessing this is probably going to have to be where our lanterns go, um, but let's go ahead and pop those out, and we'll put a couple iron bars here just to save the spot, okay? Uh, let me get a few more materials together, and I will try to finish up the ceiling uh, as best as I can. And while I grab these, I just wanted to talk a little bit about life in general. My life has kind of changed for uh, a, a weird turn in the last uh, several days, really. Um, the last few days uh, have have been a, a blur, honestly. And I'm kind of using Minecraft as a as a bit of a not an escape, but uh, just an outlet for some of my creative juices that I am uh, kind of uh, not not outputting other places at the moment. As uh, most of my viewers know, I was in school uh, for um, doing, oh dear, I was in school for music education and I was studying to be a, a band director. Well, I was in my student teaching, my, my clinical practice, so I was basically full-time student, but also full-time teacher in a, uh, in a music classroom in, the, in, in my local area. And I was, I was there every day, all day, from like 8.30 to, to like 4, pretty much, every day. And that was, uh, that was very cool. I was enjoying myself, and then this COVID-19 thing kind of hit. And it came on really strong. Um, uh, it, it kind of struck all, all at once, and, uh, basically one Friday, we were, we were saying, hey, kids, you know, it's, it's probably a good possibility that we are going to, uh, not be in school on Monday. There's a good possibility. So we were telling our kids, you know, take your instruments home, make sure you're practicing, and, you know, we might not see each other for, again for a long time, and it might be completely different. It happened, and so those of us who were student teaching, my, my friends and I, were like, well, what what are we supposed to do? You know, um, our, whoops, wow, our grades 
uh, are kind of dependent on this, you know. All right, this is our, our big final project. It's like our capstone project. And so, sure enough, over the weekend, uh, the, the, the county schools closed, and they, they said, you know, no more school. We're going online for the next two weeks. And so my friends and I said, what are we supposed to do? So we, we had a couple meetings, and basically um, the, the teachers, well, our, our teachers wanted us to go in and help uh, our, our mentor teachers, the teachers that we were teaching alongside. Uh, they wanted us to help them kind of transition. And then we had another meeting that basically said, no, uh, we changed our minds. Uh, we don't want you going in at all because we don't want you exposing our teachers or the the facilities to um, any any more than we have to, and so we were kind of stuck. We're we're thinking, well, how are we supposed to get our teacher certification? Like, what what's going to be the deal here? How are we supposed to do this? Well, um, eventually, uh, they they came out and said. Uh, student teachers, you're you're done for the rest of the semester. Uh, we want you to go home, go go to your places for spring break, and we will um, we will work it out so that you guys get your teacher certification. Um, but for now, you are um, you're done, and and we'll let you know like when the time comes, uh, when when you get your certification and all that. We'll we'll work it out so that you guys can. Uh, graduate on time. Well, we also don't have a graduation ceremony because of the president's um, president's issue of um, ten or more. It's been a really uh, challenging time uh, fairly recently here. Um, we have a lot of of uncertainties, um, but you know, life life is strange, and um, we don't always know what's going to happen. Um, but we just have to kind of hold on and um, do lots of praying because we we don't know what what's going on. Where have I put my lanterns? There we go. Uh, if you think of us, all those um, those seniors who are um, trying to complete degrees and have gotten their their grades cut short or have had to start adjusting to to online. Um, just, just think of us and, and keep us in your prayers. That's not where I wanted that to go at all. Keep us in your prayers and just, uh, try to... Oh, man, I'm going to be one short, aren't I? Oh, man. <sighs> it's, it's, a, it's a tough time, and this is how, how I'm going to spend a little bit of my time. I, I'm not going to spend a bunch of time here, obviously, because I'm not an actual content creator. I only have a few subs and, you know... I appreciate those of you who do watch, and, and this is just a way for me to share my crea creativity with those of you who do, and I appreciate you. I thank you for your for your comments and your likes, and, and they're very valuable to me. Um, it's a learning experience for us all, and um, we're just having to, to hold on. So, uh, that being said, uh, I, I will probably be doing a little bit more content creation here in the next a uh, little bit. I um, obviously, as I said, I'm not an actual content creator. I can't. I can't make this for a living. So I do have to start looking for jobs. Even though I don't. <laughs> even though my my student teaching was cut short, I I am having to look for jobs and doing job applications. So I would appreciate your support as I as I do those as well. Um, but hey, what do you think of this ceiling, right? I know the the lanterns aren't quite done, but I think it looks pretty cool. I think it's uh, it gives it a nice warm feeling, and I think it go, it'll go along well with uh, the red carpets that I've been doing all along. Um, and I may even get some red curtains going on in here. Um, but yeah, I I think that looks pretty cool. I may have to do something with this border because it looks a little bit uh, bland at the moment. I may put some some cobbly stone stairs in here. Um, but yeah. So let me go get a few more materials. Let me get that lantern back in, and I will be back in just a minute. I'm trying a little bit of a different um, approach to my my building this time, my video, um, and I'm actually doing a little bit more cuts. It adds a little bit more work for me, but I hopefully 
uh, well, hopefully it will add a little bit more excitement for you. Uh, so I have a few materials here. Um, just going to get some carpets going. Um, obviously, we're going to need to do that last because I, I want to kind of lay out the floor first. So I think what I want, the way I see this going, is I want some kind of a large couch. Whoops. I'm out. Uh, phooey. Crafting bench. Um, I want some kind of a large couch to go back here, um, and we will put that in. Something kind of like that. Whoop! Hello, you're in the wrong spot. Something kind of like that. Yeah, I like that. Um, and then we'll kind of have a, uh, a, a little bit of a coffee table here, and then we'll have a little bit of a... Uh, side table like here and here and we'll put uh, maybe a, a trap door or two on it to make it look a little bit cooler yeah something that looks a little bit like a cabinet door maybe and we'll put some some things on here in a minute uh, but then I want to have another uh, chair or two uh, man it kind of stinks that this room is on an even I think we'll make this one uh, a two wide chair and we'll put some uh, we'll put some dark oak trap doors on it like this yeah that looks good I've got it I've got it okay here we go so hear me out I think what I want to do is I want to place a couple of these down but not there. I want to put them. Uh, Whoo! That's never gonna go away, is it? What is this? What is this on? So what I want to do is I want to put those spruce trap doors down, and those will kind of add um, a little bit of a, a, a table feel to this, uh, a wooden table. And obviously, I'm gonna want to put a couple of a couple of those on the sides here. Uh, maybe I'll put these, these other trapdoors, to kind of make them look like uh, legs. Yes! Yes, that's what I want. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, now, my question is can I put. Whoops! Nope. Can't. Okay, that's fine. So we'll put them on uh, on the sides of these and kind of do like so, kind of wrap it around like that. And I think maybe even what we'll do, uh, since we're kind of changing the bottom anyway, we will move these and we will make, we'll add a little bit of interest and we'll plop these out and we'll put some actual real red wool blocks in here like this. So that'll kind of add some interest and it'll make it look like one big carpet with maybe some some dynamic interest so like that all right let's go pick up those blocks because i don't like mi i don't like missing blocks that's 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 not good okay so we've kind of gotten this half of the room done uh with these these trap doors i'm gonna put something on these don't don't worry never you fret don't worry um and i think i think this is cool i think it looks good um and so now we're gonna work on this half of the room now remember i want to make these uh, these rooms as Minecraft functional as possible. Obviously, we can't sit in chairs yet. Uh, that's that, that might be something that Mojang decides to add in the future. But one of the things I do want to add functionality to is uh, I want there to be a crafting bench or some kind of useful item in in the in each room. So one of the things I want to do is add. Uh, crafting bench in here somewhere. So let me think about that for just a minute and I'll get back. Uh, I just got off the phone about um, some stuff regarding an application that I just did. So uh, that was kind of an important phone call. I apologize. Uh, so anyway, where was I? Um, yes, so I think what I want to do now is I want to put a little bit of a cabinet like right here. Um, so we'll still have a little bit of room to kind of get by right here, but I want to put a cabinet right here. And one of the best ways to do that 
is to make some barrels. I think barrels look very good as cabinets. You can also put stuff on top of them, and you can store stuff inside them. They're, they're, they're very wonderful. So let's go ahead and put some, whoops. Let's go ahead and put those on the ends. I think that looks very nice. And then let's go ahead and put something on top. What can we put on top? I'm gonna put white for right now. We can always change it, but I think I'm going to put white for right now. Yeah. Now, I kind of wanted to work out this other side here. Um, let's see. We're going to keep the dark oak going. And let's make this right here kind of a corner couch thing right here. And let's put um, a, another couple right there, kind of keep it squared up. Let's put some bookshelves here. And, ooh, that's awfully contrasty. I wish we could make some uh, custom wood uh, bookshelves, so like if we could make dark oak bookshelves and stuff like that, but uh, that's okay for the moment. Um, we'll put some up here, and then we can kind of make some cabinet stuff going on there, and some there spruce trap doors can go uh, here whoop nope not like that like that and and hmm. that perfect nailed it all right need another one another couple spruce trap doors spruce spruce goodness Cut a couple barrels and put trap door there and I need one more so let's use spruce, make a couple more of these, and this in here, trap doors, and boink, and there we go. So that's nice on the inside, and then we can put one like right there. Hmm. Yes. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, 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 yes, 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 yes. Hold, please, hold, please. Let's make another couple trap doors, and boom. All right, now bear with me. I, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, hey, man, it, it doesn't line up, but yes, it, it does line up. Hold on, please, please hold, please hold. I'm going to get myself some decorations, decorations. I'm going to get, uh, where are you? Yes, one of you. And let's get. Um, what am I looking for? What am I looking for? I want clay. Where's my clay? Clay's in here. Yes, clay. One, two, three. And then I want item frames. I don't have any item frames, do I? No, I do not. Well. Hmm. Hmm. Whoops. Get right. Okay, well, for now, let's just stick with what we have, um, and just, we're, we're gonna imagine for a second, okay? So let's get back upstairs, and oops, it's nighttime. I'll, I'll sleep in a second, don't worry. All right, so let's go ahead and make a pot, perfect, and my inventory's a mess, and that's okay. So let's, let's go, yeah, whoops, that's not right, give me that back. There we go, and put the spruce, ta-da! And then we can have a place right here for something, and yes, and then we can also put an item frame here, I believe, even though this trapdoor is here, and that will be all really cool. All right, I'm excited about that. That looks cool. That looks really cool. Can I open this? Yes, good. Okay, awesome. And we're back. All right, so here we go. Item frame, put one there. Yes, and book. Yes, well, not like that. All right, book. Yes, very fine. And put one up here. What can I do? I, hey, yeah, whoop, that's not what I meant to do. Here, give me a block, block, and yeah, whoop, nope, oh, ooh, there we go, okay. Um, can I do, what can I do with that? Hmm. Right, right here? No, I was going to do an item frame right here, and I was going to put this right here. Since I never used that, I figured, well, I could put that someplace really cool. So I think right there would be cool. Uh, I wanted to get another pot and see if I could plop it there while still having that there. I think that would add a lot of cool detail. All right? Fantastic. Uh, 
Uh, but, um, well, uh, let's put let's put that there then. Mm -hmm. Don't pop. Do not pop. Right. Uh, I think I'm going to take this off for the moment. Uh, I don't quite know what to put there. Here we go. Let's watch this. Button. Boop. And let's see. Cobble of stone. Cobble of stone. Ready. Boop. And whoops. There we go. It's like a little a uh, little trinket, like a, a little a little table topper. And uh, I wish I could um. I wish I could get some kind of uh. Well, first of all, I wish I had end rods, but you know, <laughs> I'm still working on that. You know that. And I'm back with one of my favorite, most favoritest flowers in all of Minecraft. Ah, it's so beautiful. I love it so much. The oak trap door. Um, one right. Let's put one right here. Whoops. No, not right there. One right, uh, right, uh, yes. Here, oop. That's weird. Um, did anyone else do that? Huh, okay. And then let's put one right here. Yes, very fine. And I need more spruce trapdoors. Spruce, 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 spruce. One, two. And there we go. Yep. A couple of those. And one right here. And one right here. Mm -hmm. Yes, perfect. Beautiful. I think that looks nice, 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 nice. And then we'll put, ooh, I need another oak trap door, or dark oak. All right, so let's go ahead and put some carpet in on this side. So I'm gonna have to knock you out, put like something there. And then I'm gonna need one right here, and then one right here and here. All right, so now, now the last thing we need to work on is something on top of these these tables and then my picture frames i need more picture frames oh uh, also I, I i can do i can do another one of those bookshelves right here bah, 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 bah. there we go yes perfect all right now i need paintings and here we go all right some of the last finishing touches and boom no not you go get away yeah eh. there we go that's what i want okay perfect uh-huh. Yeah. I like that. Okay. And then something kind of right here. All right. Well. Oh, wait, no. Something on the tables. I need something on the tables. Watch and learn. Boop. And boop. Nuts. Wrong pressure plate. I said watch and learn. Hiya. Voila. A book on a uh, platter thing. Okay, perfect. And then something over here. Ta-da! Paper. Well, here we go. Let's call this a completed job. A job well done. Let's just take a take a little perusal here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very proud. And this was all, mo well, mostly, mostly on camera. And we got a little crossbow back in there. Yeah, very fine, very fine work indeed. And, and we even have some stuff in these, whoops, which I should probably get out. <laughs> and boop, there we go, okay. Very fine, a cup. Pretend it's a cup, okay? It's a cup. And now I can pick one of these up, and boop. And look at that beautiful ceiling. Ah, oh, yes. You know what I just thought? I really hope I didn't change the, the floor up here. Oh, good. I guess. Hey, that's pretty cool. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Uh, we'll catch you guys in the next episode. And thank you. Uh, th thank you for bearing with me as I kind of do. Whoops. Chair squeaked. Thank you for bearing with me as I have um, a lot of different things going on right now. Uh, appreciate your support on this series and uh, on my building as I try to become a better creative Minecrafter as I just kind of relax and make videos for you guys, uh, those of you who actually watch. So thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next episode, probably coming pretty soon. See ya!